What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with Life Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my great subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, um, Pisces, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a um, hashtag glow up for Sana Pisces for June 2022. This can resonate if you have Pisces in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Feminine in the Jupiter chart. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply that clock, everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Hashtag glow up is a little different um, than my other readings. It's a, it's a positive counterpart to the truth hidden. Truth hidden is basically the secrets and the nasty grimy stuff people don't want you to know. Glow Up is focusing on healing, growth, acceptance, uh, manifestation in a positive way, um, all the po positive, healthy things on a light side um, aspect. So um, just to let you guys know the difference, because I've had several newbies on the channel recently. And by the way, thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. We're 13,050 subscribers. So thanks so much, you guys, for all the love and support. I just want to say that real quick, too. Okay. If you guys feel guided to donate, it's High Priestess Tarot 5. The link's in the description box below if you would like to donate. Only if you feel guided to donate, okay? No pressure, I promise. Okay. Spirit messages you have some. Okay, wow, they're flying out, Pisces. I haven't received any channeling yet. Okay. Hidden helpers is what I just heard. Hidden helpers? Okay. I just heard hidden helpers just now. By the way, these are psychic intuitive messages. I do psychic intuitive messages with cards. So um, that's the name of the game for me. So just to let you guys know, new to the channel, okay? Uh, hidden helpers. So <clears throat> I feel you have hidden helper or helpers, or you're about to be a hidden helper to person, people, place, family, or situation. However, that resonates and applies on one's life, Pisces. Only you know your story, not anybody else, okay? You have to plug it in how it resonates, if it does resonate for you. Um, one message may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply. Only you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else, okay? Spare messages you have sign of Pisces. Okay. For some, you could be dealing with a fire sign, or you could be taking on fire sign energy, however that resonates, or you could have fire in your chart. If you do, um, or if you are dealing with fire sign, or have fire in your chart, or taking on fire sign energy, dealing with Aries Leo Sagittarius energy, um, you could have Aries Leo Sag in your chart. Somebody else could. You plug it in how it resonates. Aries Leo Sagittarius energy, the lion energy. Also, you have my Bago, the warrior saint, untangling ne neglect, gorse. When I lean on certainty and faith, I change my mind about the world I see. Number 13 could be a very significant number in one's life, number 13. It could be a possible age of a child of yours or somebody you're, you're, you're connected to or any other significant num uh, number in one's life, number 13. Um, I'm going to look up, since it's springtime, I put in the spring cards, the flower cards. So I've been looking up the symbolisms for these um, cards for the signs. So we're going to do it. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay, so I'll do it when we get there. Okay. All right. Lion. A particular Pisces is about to roar, about to speak some truth. They did not speak it in the past, and they're about to speak it now. Some, they were blackmailed not to say anything, but they are about to say now. Some, they were scared to say, they're about to say it now. Some, they lied, they're about to say it now. Whoa! Plug it in, how it resonates, Pisces. This is strong. I mean, good but strong energy. 
So this is you. This is you. You're the taking on the lion energy here. If this resonates for you, wow. So for some, you were blackmailed not to say, some you were blackmailed not to say some kind of truth in person, in some kind of situation regarding person, people, place, family, situation, organization, etc. Some you were blackmailed. You're about to speak it now. Some you were, uh, you lied. You're about to speak it now. Some you, uh, what was the other one? You were blackmailed. You were li um, you lied. And there was another one. Oh, you were scared. You were scared, but you're going to speak it now. So for some, you were blackmailed not to tell the truth, but you're about to speak it now. For some, you intentionally lied. It sounds like free willingly intentionally lied, but you're about to say it now. For some, you were scared to say the truth, and you're about to say it now. Uh, for some, you could have lied because you were scared, maybe, or blackmailed, however that resonates. But you are about to speak it now. Um, however that resonates in one slide, okay? For some, it's regarding legal situations. Very important now. Summits regarding legal situations, it's very important now. Okay, so for summits regarding legal situations, and it's very important now to do it. So so you don't perjure yourself or perjure somebody or a situation or et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, is what I'm presuming here. Um, but only you know your situation, not anybody else. Regarding some kind of legal situation or situations, for some, it's regarding an investigation. For some, it's regarding investigation. Some, it's regarding legal matters. So, only you know your situation and story, not anybody else, you guys. But you're about to roar and speak the truth. If it's not, if you're not speaking the truth regarding a legal matter or investigation, it could be anything else. You were blackmailed not to say, scared not to say, or just lie. However that resonates, okay? But you're definitely, this is your energy. You were taking on fire sign energy and roaring and speaking the truth. I don't think it's like, rah, you know, like craziness, but the fire sign energy of bravery and courage, basically, is what I'm feeling here. Okay. That's, I'm Leo, so that's my energy. I love it. Just saying, saying. Okay. My Bago, the warrior saint. I'm a warrior of love. My devotion attracts resources and support. Advocacy energy strong for one Pisces. Advocacy energy strong for one Pisces. So you plug it in how it resonates. So one of you guys is going to be an advocate by speaking the truth for a person, people, place, family, or situation, or organization is what I'm feeling um, for at least one. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. Advocacy energy is really beautiful. I just want to point that out. It really is. Um, I'm a nurse. Anybody knows I've been a nurse, RN, since 2013, licensed since 2013. I started practicing in 2014. But as nurses, medical professionals, nursing, you're taught advocacy. Stand up for your patients. Stand up for the patient's rights. Stand up for the patient's period. Um, because they are under your care um, and your license when you're on shift. And that's just the truth. So, I mean, I'm not saying you're a nurse or a medical professional, whoever you are, Pisces, that's about to take on this advocacy energy with your lion energy. Um, you can be an advocate for anybody in any field, any field. Um, and I'm just being real. I just speak from a nursing perspective because I'm a nurse. But that's really beautiful is what I'm saying. You're about to become an advocate, I think, for somebody else. Maybe for some, somebody's about to advocate for you. Because um, I heard advocacy. So energy is going to reverse. So for some, maybe somebody's about to advocate for you. For some, you're about to advocate for somebody else. For some, it could be both. You plug it in how it resonates, okay? But I think this advocacy is about to come out of love and support for either you or for somebody else. And that's really beautiful because we need more of that energy in the world. We really, really do. Um, the world has become such a cold place. It really has. Um, it really has. And we need more love in the world. And I'm not talking about I'm not talking about sex want energy. I'm talking about true love, like caring and affection towards others in a platonic, healthy, universal way. Not a weird black magic, sex magic, sex want kind of way. Not, not that. Not, not at all. Yikes. Um, but that really is beautiful energy. Untangling neglect. I take the time to give myself all the approval I desire. Desire. 
Self-care is about to become very, very, very significant in a Pisces life. Realize they need to take time out for themselves. But that's beautiful. I heard self-care is about to become very, very significant in Pisces life. Uh, realize they need to take time out for themselves. So for whoever you are and that message applies for, I feel you take care of a lot of people. Um, for some, I feel you could be a medical professional or manager, boss, supervisor, or CEO of anything. But I, I feel you either manage people or manage, I feel you manage people. I feel you manage people for some, or you could be um, a medical professional. I feel for some, you might be medical professionals, or you just take on a, a workload, a heavy workload, whatever you do, out in the 3D or at home. For some, I feel you could be um, single, um, not single mothers, um, Stay home mothers. Feel you can be stay home mothers for some. However that resonates, however that resonates, you take care of other people. Whether you get paid for it or whether you don't. And that's just the truth. Okay? Um, and you're about to find self-care in yourself. So I think you've neglected yourself in this aspect. And you're about to self-care yourself. Taking the time out. I don't, I mean, whatever that is. I mean, milk baths, spiritual baths, a facial, um, doing some push-ups i mean whatever it is um you plug it in how it resonates that's really beautiful so untangling the neglect of yourself taking time out for yourself let me see if i hear anything else and speaking on abuse and speaking on abuse is what i just heard and one of you guys is about to speak on abuse there's a lot of fire sign speaking up energy here i mean there was before i got that channeling a lot somebody's about to speak up on 